The heartbroken mother of a murder victim speaks to Fox 29 about the point blank shooting of her 28 year old daughter. It comes as violence against women in particular is spiking in Philadelphia. I'm Shana Humphreys. I'm Jason Martinez. 60 women have been killed in Philadelphia so far this year, a 50% increase from last year. Our Kelly Rule live at police headquarters tonight. Kelly. Yeah, Jason and Shana, a disturbing trend we're seeing here in the city and the family of 28 year old Shemeca Franklin tells me she was a mom to an eight year old, a two year old and only an eight month old. Police say she was shot at point blank range six times. A murder they feel was premeditated. You took my daughter away from me. You took my daughter away from her kids. Fatima Johnson says her 28 year old daughter Shemeca Franklin was a mother to three eight years old, two years old, and eight months old. Police say this man was clearly looking for her at Willard and G Streets in Kensington around five in the evening Sunday. Here's the surveillance video. As soon as she gets close, police say he fires at least six times at point blank range, killing her. This is obviously a very premeditated act. Very important that we get this individual off the street. Uh, this is a, a, an act that, that really, when you watch the video, uh, it's horrific to see this, this act. And it's brutal. This is per it looks like it, this is personal. 40 women were killed in 2020. This year, 60 women were killed, and the year is not over. Police say domestic motives in this year's homicides are up 94%, though they don't know if that's the case in Franklin's murder. She didn't see this coming. She didn't see it coming at all. Wednesday, police also asked for the public's help in two other cases. The double murder of 56-year-old Constance Marshall and 31-year-old Irene McNair in an illegal speakeasy on Ridge Avenue Thursday night. And the whereabouts of 33-year-old James White, accused of shooting his girlfriend on October 28th. Johnson, too, wants justice. She didn't deserve this. Nobody deserved to die like she did. That was brutal what you did. Turn yourself in. Because you will be caught. You will be caught. And I have no mercy on you. Now, police did say today they are working with their partners to uh, try to be proactive and prevent this violent trend from continuing. Of course, anybody with any information on any of these cases is asked to come forward. Shana. Kelly Rule, live at police headquarters. Thank you.